Hello, I am Jacques Albert, Pope of Cherries. In order to keep you busy during the confinement, I invite you to paint cherries. It's easy and the result will surprise you. Okay, you start by painting a red circle on a piece of paper or a piece of cardboard of your choice. With some red, kind of dark and common red. So I make one on the blue background and one on the black white background. Just to show you. If you want to do a red background, you can brown, yellow, everything is good. Okay, now you apply like a quarter moon of burnt sienna on the left side of the cherry, and a little zit here on the top corner, the top corner of the cherry. <laughs> Oops, I don't zit yet. There we go. Okay, now you apply a little vermilion red, some brighter red of some sort. And the cherry on the right center. And then you rub your finger to spread it a little bit. That's it. Okay, now with a small brush, you paint a fine line of pink on the left side of your cherry. A little dot here. There we go. Then in the same pink, you put a drop here and you rub your finger again to spread it a little bit. Something here. So now a little white dot to make the cherry shine on the center of the pink. Okay, now you trace a fine line of dark brown right next to the pink here. Okay, now I'm going to paint the stem with dark green. Stem can be either straight or, or not, a little bit. You know. Okay, now we're going to do the last light green on top of the dark green. Try not to cover it completely. Yeah, now last but not least. Uh, I'm going to paint the shadow of the cherry. It's very important. Okay, so you use a darker tone background, whatever color you've chosen. So on white, it will be gray. And I feel like my hat is falling down. Shit. Now you take a picture of your artwork or you scan it for a bit of result and then send it to papdesoris at gmail.com. Your artworks will be shown on my site at jacquesalbert.com.